Hey y'all, this is Jason, KO4DDG. Today, I'm going to show you how to use WinSCP to configure your Raspberry Pi. First, you want to download it and install it, but I'm not going to show that to you today because y'all probably already done that. So, you're going to come up to a login screen. First thing you want to do is change the file protocol to SCP. Next, you want to type your host name. That's your IP address. Then you want to do your port number, whichever port number you set. Your username, your password. Then you want to hit advance. From advance, you want to go to shell. And from shell, you want to go to su, sudo su dash. This will allow you to edit files on the system. If you don't do that, you can't do that. Then you want to hit log in. First time logging in, you're going to come up to a dialog asking you to accept the key. Just go ahead and accept. You're going to be put into the root folder. Go up for one, and over here, serve will show your HDMI files to edit for Supermon or Allmon. ETC, asterisk, will have all your configuration files for your repeater. Let's go ahead and go into RPT. Here, you have a word editor that opens up, and you can just drag it wherever you want it. Be sure to check out my other video where I show you how to use a scheduler. You can come up with a quite complex schedule. Any other way, this was Jason KO4DDG73. Catch you all later.